Did Edfast really beat me the other day? Edfast. Oh, from position. Oh, Edfast beat me. Let's get revenge. I'm also curious. Oh, it's a Traxler. It's a. Oh, I'm white. Ah! I, so, if I play against a Traxler, I prefer to take with Bishop so I don't get mated instantly. This is kind of scary. Which platform has been the most rewarding? They're different in different ways. Yeah, it's, it's hard to like pick one over the other. I mean, YouTube, YouTube definitely has a larger... It's just a larger platform in general. Is it my move? Oh, it's my move. Oh, free queen. I was waiting for black to play a move because this is like the main... <laughs> it's a mainline position. But my, when my opponent customized the position, they forgot to set it to black to move. That's so funny. <laughs> we, we both thought it was black's move. <laughs> you'll, you'll have to send me another challenge. Oh, game aborted. Oh, I won a queen and then opponent aborts. Our glorious leader. Ah, I'm forced into a Traxler. I don't even... Man, what's the line? I don't even Traxler, bro. I mean, king f1 seems illogical. I know I'm supposed to take and then do something. I'm scared my opponent's booked up. But YOLO. Thanks for subbing. Jameis Bon. 11. I'm thinking king e3. How bad is this? If I play king e3, black's still forked and the knight's hanging. And then maybe I can win king of the hill. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, there's queen h4. Oh, it's 302, man. So I, I have no time to, like, think thoroughly. I know there's some other lines, but king e3, king e3 seems like the move my opponent would be least prepared for. Ah, opponent's prepared. I have this move. Oh, there's knight g3. And if I take the rook... Oh, queen f4 is coming. Ooh. This is a nasty opening. I should, I should try this someday. I mean, I might as well go for this line and pray. If it takes, I think I can get away with taking the rook, queen d4, king f3. King f3 here. There's rook f. Oh, there's casting. Oh, this is probably prep. This is almost certainly prep. Wow, what a move. Ah, I'm scared. I'm also maybe getting mated, kind of. I have this move. This is rough. This move. How do I not lose instantly? Ah, the bishop's coming in too. Wow, what a move. And this move. I'm so down on time as well. My up material? What's material? I'm up a bishop for two pawns, but I'm about to lose a bishop. That was such a strong opening. It was move castling. Forgot it was legal. But thankfully, I'm threatening the queen trade. And the queen doesn't have a weight. Oh, it does. Ooh. I, I can't. Oh, this is a mate threat. I wanted to take, but this is made in two. Ah, queen f3 is also. I have queen d1, maybe. So the goal is just to survive. Hello. Hello. Please help me. Actually, don't help me. I can I can do this alone, maybe. I just have two goals. Don't get mated and don't get flagged.
Okay, let's, uh, opponent wants to mate me again. Oh, we could, oh, draw, maybe? We could repeat. Oh, we had this position twice already. I'd be, I'd be thrilled with a draw. Ooh, okay, so we're trading... Mm, I have to stop bishop f3. It's still a difficult position, though. Play this move. I'm losing pawns all over the place. Oh, let's trade at least. I'm down about 50 seconds. Oh, that's a good move. Why do I not get forked? That was a really good move. I have to play King G2, I guess. Control F3. And then Bishop D2. Uh, opponent's bullet rating. Oh, opponent doesn't... Oh, does play bullet. No, doesn't play bullet. That's only blitz. Okay. So I have some hope. Da. Ah! Okay, opponent missed knight c2, winning, winning material. E5 is now hanging. With rook e7, I play this move. Okay. Let's win a pawn. Mm. My time, my beautiful time. What am I mating? Not quite mating. It was close to mate. Ah. Let's go. Oh, I was so close to flagging there. Oh, I was really close. I was like a near death experience. Thanks for the game. Oh, thanks for the bits. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. I mean, this opening was actually really incredible, like really impressive. I was just, I was probably toast, but somehow I didn't get mated and I didn't flag. I wonder, has this been played before, this casting move? Really? Ben Feingold had this position. That's so funny. Johnstone Glenn, or Glenn Johnstone against Benjamin Feingold, 1992. That was before I was born. Wow. Ben Feingold was 2490 before I was born. That's crazy. Oh, so castling... I mean, castling equalizes? Oh, I had a, f a fancy move, rook h4. That's crazy. I maybe should have found that. That's a really cool idea, actually. To attack the queen, defend the bishop, and keep this alignment. Just started med school, but still watch mm. in my spare time. Oh, nice to hear. Play a Benoni for me one day. Oh, someday. Yeah, for you and for Ben. Benoni's name for Ben. Well, good luck with med school. Yeah, computer doesn't like this position for white. So was King E3 a, a playable move? I guess it is playable. This is like the this is the one theoretical game. Um so queen d4. Oh, maybe castling 
Wait, this is actually really interesting. So castling is an improvement to the Ben Vinegal game. Good wow. Morning from Finland. Hey, never been it's here? Finland. I've never been to Finland. But I want to go at some point. Um, someday. What time is it in Finland? Probably the morning. Thank you, Pukseli, for the money. The 470 is probably like a normal number of like whatever the Finnish currency is. Wow, so I, I'm assuming this is probably some sort of theory. Rook h4 and then e4 check. King g2. Oh, this is... Yeah, this is really crazy. This requires more extensive analysis. Um, but thanks for the game, Adfost. That was fun. <laughs> I hope you're not too broken after that. Uh, this will probably go on YouTube. Um, so, YouTube people, hope you enjoyed that. You can say hi to Twitch chat. Twitch chat providing so much energy. Um, you can follow and subscribe and watch on Twitch. Link is always on, in the description to watch on Twitch.